Matty Graham here from Exponential Performance Coaching. Welcome back to another Whiteboard Wednesday. Now before we get into it, make sure you hit the subscribe button over here so that you subscribe to this YouTube channel. When you do that, you're going to get notifications as soon as I upload a new video so you don't miss out on any of my latest training tips and information. Today we're going to be tackling the question about chocolate milk. Why is chocolate milk good for recovery? Let's take a look. Now chocolate milk, this is an interesting one. Every now and then, chocolate milk pops its head up and explodes back onto the fitness and sort of athlete scene for recovery. Now, it's not like it's a new player in the game, it's been around for a long time. Research on chocolate milk has been going on for a long time, and it just seems that when a new company puts out a new brand or they try and get in, in the mix, it, it sort of springs up again. But chocolate milk, proven by the research to be very effective, as effective as especially formulated sports foods, for recovery. So let's take a look at why that is and why chocolate milk is this good recovery food rather than just thinking of, of this mysterious nature's own sports drink as it's sometimes referred to. So why is chocolate milk good for recovery? Well, one of the key things for recovery is protein. And milk naturally has about 20% whey protein and 18%, sorry, 80% casein protein. Whey protein is your fast release protein. Casein protein is slightly slower release, so you get a more even distribution. This combination here is quite effective for recovery. If you've ever heard of curds and whey, when you uh, coagulate milk, casein clumps together to make the curds, whey is the liquid component just out of interest so good protein profile the other important aspect for recovery is carbohydrate now uh, chocolate milk all the research is done on chocolate milk but flavored milk in general doesn't really matter the flavoring component adds more carbohydrate they dump a bunch of sugar in to make it sweet and taste like chocolate banana strawberry whatever it is and that added sugar is obviously carbohydrate. Bumps up the carbohydrate component and it gives us this magical three to one or four to one carbohydrate to protein ratio, which is crucial for recovery. So we've got a good carbohydrate profile in there. Protein is gonna provide amino acids to build your muscle cells, build connective tissue, new blood vessels, new blood cells, all those enzymes that are required for improved performance carbohydrates going to refuel those muscles over here interesting enough milk on its own is actually better than sports drink or water in terms of fluid retention there's a bit of research done showed that when flavored milk or milk was consumed urine output following uh, during that recovery period was lower so the person is actually retaining the fluid holding on to it better rather than just peeing it out. And if you retain the fluid, you're able to better hydrate those cells in the body. Cost, cost is a big one. If you've ever gone and brought a big tub of recovery, protein, whatever it is, you know it's quite expensive. Flavored milk, chocolate milk has the opportunity of being a lot less expensive than especially formulated sports food. So in a nutshell, that is why chocolate milk is very good for recovery. Key thing you need to focus on is that all the research that's been done has been done on low fat chocolate milk. And low fat uh, flavored milk is really important that it's the low fat component because fat reduces the absorption of carbohydrates and protein in the gut. It can be hard in some countries to find that low fat option so you might want to go with just standard trim milk, add your own chocolate uh, or flavoring component to it and that can get around that loophole. 
If you found this video interesting, please make sure you subscribe so you keep up to date with all of my latest training information and tips. If you want to know more about recovery nutrition, make sure you check out the recovery video over here about what to eat and when to eat it. And also, if you found chocolate milk interesting, why don't you check out this other video over here about how beetroot can improve your performance. Get that information, make sure you apply it to your training so you can train harder, but most importantly, train smarter.